Thank you so much. Insane. <laughs> You can't judge someone that looks hot, like you just can't. I feel like the waffles are staring at me as if like I'm crazy. I spoke to my ex. I'm drunk. Do I want to be a whore? Maybe. Hi, it's India. I'm currently editing this video. I'm in England right now. And can I just say, I didn't realize how much my American accent was coming out in this video. And did my other New York vlog, but it was a lot. Blame that on being in Texas for like three weeks before New York. But regardless, I'm cringing. Hi guys. No, I'm not naked. Hello. Hi guys. I just got out of the shower. I'm running late. I have an appointment in literally five minutes and I have to get out here and walk there too for my waxing because... <laughs> I'm not looking too good. I wanted to do a glow up video today. Today's my first like official full day in New York. I need a little bit of a glow up. My nails are looking kind of ratchet. I already did a workout today, so I guess that kind of counts as my part of my glow up. I gotta get out of here, so let's go ladies. Ugh, so I just took all my vitamins. It's now literally officially 9 a.m., so I'm running late. Yeah, I look cute. Let's go start the day. I'm running so late, what do I do? Okay, should I just, I'll shove this in here, close it up, because when they come and, you know, do the broom. Is this all good? This needs to be thrown away. Okay, everything else is pretty much good. Off I trot. Let's go, ladies. Key card? Yes, I have a key card. I'll bring both. Let's go. Let's go roam the city of New York. Ah! Trying to walk there right now. I feel nice and clean, which is good. I have a hair mask in right now. I look a little insane. Oh, I see it. That's it. I'm at Sugaring, New York City. I hope they don't judge me that I'm gonna walk in there with like literally soaking wet hair. Is that rude? Is that rude to walk in there with wet hair? Look, I'm here. I don't know why he is so pink and so cute. Look at the room. I'm like naked, apart from the top. I'm getting half leg, full Brazilian, and underarms. So I just got fully waxed. I'm feeling very smooth and amazing. Halfway through, I started really needing to pee. So like, let's go. That was great. So just got done on my waxing. Put my hair in a little bun because it was like getting annoying. Oh, look at this New York. I can finally vlog and put my arms up without feeling insecure about being hairy. Thank you so much. I got my coffee and I got my bagel. So this is my first time trying a New York bagel. That is so good. Hi. Guys, how is this so good? Like this is insane. Wow. Guys, I'm drinking my coffee and I'm on FaceTime to my mom. Say hi. Yeah, so, oh, they can't even hear you actually, I just realized because I have my airpods in. I'm running late to my nail appointment. So guys, the bagel is really good. Now I'm just at the nail salon. I'm going to get my nails done and my toes. I'm going to get like a pedicure and a manicure. Look, it's Audrey Hepburn. So guys, my toes are done. I'm so extra that I got these because I wanted them to match my Louboutins. This is the picture that I showed I wanted. And these are my nails and I'm going to get them painted like... They're pretty nude, so they're natural. They're gonna be like glossy looking. Yes, my nails are done. These are exactly what I wanted. It's not gonna focus, but... Oh! I got my waxing and my nails done. My nails look so good. They're just really clean. This is exactly what I wanted. Natural, pretty, like... Oh, I love New York so much. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I'm getting a little bit tired, but I just know I can't stay here and sleep and nap. It just isn't gonna work. We're gonna keep going. I was like falling asleep in the chair while she was doing my nails. It was quite nice. I have a massage at 3 p.m. I think it's coming up on 1 right now. So I have like two hours till that and like I don't want to go and get lunch because I'm not hungry. I had a fat bagel and my stomach hurts a little bit from the bagel. I kind of want to actually explore Cha Cha Matcha because I know they have a Cha Cha Matcha here. So that'd be really fun to go to Chacha Matcha in New York. I just don't want to waste my day, you know? Like, I don't know what to do to fill this, like, couple hours that I have. It's also not like I'm going to be taking Instagram pictures either. I don't want to go somewhere that I intend on taking Instagram pictures and then have to go back there again another day so that I can actually get the Instagram pictures, you know? I'd rather do that all at once. So I'm thinking, like, ugh. I'm gonna change my shoes just because Apple's ones, they're like cute, but they're honestly not the comfiest. Don't get me wrong, they're comfy. After too long of walking in these, like it gets uncomfortable. Also room service is coming soon, as in like housekeeping. Yeah, these are my fave shoes for uh, for walking. Oh, they are so comfortable. Hair in a bun vibe. Also, yes, I'm peeling. 
don't judge me. I spent a little too much time in the sun. Okay, it happens people. I've drank two coffees so far. I don't know why, I just like, coffee always makes me feel like kind of gross with my teeth afterwards. So cool, I got the purple drink obviously. I got my drink, look how cute this is. They are playing Good Days by Scissor. I don't think this is even better. Let's compare, let's see which one's better, cha-cha in New York or cha-cha in LA. Okay, you can definitely taste the lavender a lot more than the one over here. I'm gonna say New York wins. I wanna move to New York. I really need to, but look how cute this is. Like it's so like nice vibes here. Oh, the people, the people at the LA cha-cha matcha just like give such bad vibes. That's what I'm saying. Okay, I made a friend at Cha Cha Matcha. This is Brianna. Hi. She lives in New Jersey, so she comes up like every like once in a while. She's gonna come up tomorrow to take pic Instagram <laughs> pictures, and like I was like, I need to take Instagram pictures too, so I'm gonna see you tomorrow too to take yes. Instagram pictures. We're gonna take such cute pictures. And I sat down, and she was like, Oh my goodness, you look so cute. And so I was like, Oh my god, come sit with me. And so we just like talked and became friends. She was like the cutest, and she like walked in, and I was like, Oh my god, I need to be friends with her. Like I literally need to be. Oh, I love this for me. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> Guys, I can't believe I made a friend. I made a friend. I don't have friends and I made a friend. I'm so happy. Guys, I've already done 8,000 steps today. Look how magical New York is. I'm just at the place to get my massage. This will be nice like after all the traveling and stuff. So I get to have a 60 minute massage. I got this off of Groupon, so we'll see how it is. I just came out of my massage. Can you tell I'm like really, like I'm tired now? All right, it's coming up on 5 p.m. I'm like really tired right now. Just like wanna go to sleep. I'm back! So it's 5.30, my dinner reservation is for seven. How long do I have? I have like an hour and a half. Is it 5.30 or is it, I don't know what time it is. But yeah, glow up time! <laughs> This is my favorite part. This is where we get to see all the magic happen. I made dinner reservations for myself at Zuma tonight. Fancy, fun. Basically just like fancy, delicious sushi. By myself. Yes, I'm going out to eat by myself tonight and I'm gonna put on my Louboutins for it. I'm gonna look like a bad bitch whilst doing so. My hair mask is still in my hair. Yeah, let's go with the glow up. Let's do this. Let's go, ladies. Whew, shower all done. Feeling good. Like I should. Oh, and I can put my armpits up now. Time to film my before glow up TikToks. Wow. I'm looking in the mirror and oh, I look so good. I felt so bloated like a couple days ago. My entire bloating's gone down. Oh, my. I'm like shook at how good I look. Like, okay, I pretty much just did my entire head of hair. I blow dried it and I'm like doing like a straight, like I'm using the straightness to create like a loose wave. I was gonna show me doing the last piece because that's all I have left to show. Basically, I'm like in a rush, I realized, because I do this all the time where I give myself literally like the perfect amount of time. Like, I give myself plenty of time, more, like two hours to get ready. And then I'm like, so chill the entire time because I'm like, oh, I have two hours to get ready. Because I'm so chill, I end up wasting majority of the time. And I always end up stressed. So that is what is going on right now. But anyway, my hair's done. Oh, wow, looks amazing, looks fabulous. Makeup time. I wanna look really good today. Well, duh. It's my glow up season, guys. Glow up time. I'm like still like kind of mentally preparing the outfit in my head. I'm wearing my Louboutins for sure, but I can't decide whether I want to wear it with a dress or if I want to wear it with like leather pants, a jacket, and like a hot top. I'm trying to decide still. I mean, I got my legs waxed today, so it'd be really nice to like, you know, show that off. I mean, okay, I could wear my Louboutins and like this really cute dress that I have. Oh, I can't decide whether I want to, because the thing is, is the dresses what I have are pretty dressed up. I mean, like, I don't really care, it's New York. You can never be overdressed for New York. Like, I could stand out a little, be, like, extra hot. Especially if I'm going by myself. I feel like if I go by myself dressed lame, like, that just, if I'm doing something by myself, I may as well just go all out and just look, like, really hot whilst doing it. Because then, if I look hot, people can't, like, judge me, you know what I mean? Like, you can't judge someone that looks hot, like, you just can't. If I'm dressed, like, really hot and I've got Louboutins on, like, no one can judge me oh i'm like you can tell i'm struggling foundation i'm mixing maybelline and tom ford oh i didn't even have time to pluck my eyebrows like i was supposed to for this glow up contour ow i'm doing this so aggressively i literally scratched myself with like the side of the brush should i just do my makeup and then come back or do you guys want to chill and chat with me whilst i do this oh i'm just stressed like i don't know how interesting i'm gonna be when i'm like trying to get shit done you know what i'm gonna fi i'll film me doing my makeup 
and then I'll just do a voiceover or something in the background so you guys can kind of be involved but like I'm not gonna talk to you guys right now sorry I'm busy is this gonna work can it work oh yeah there we go Sorry, I was running late, bear with me. So then I like to blend that out. Sorry if I sound really nasally right now, I'm like sick. I'm, I don't have COVID, okay? I swear I don't have COVID, but I'm sick. So anyway, cream highlighter was Charlotte Tilbury. This concealer is Maybelline. Um, I blend this out and then I put on powder. The only powder that does not give me flashback, Laura Mercier. Then I like to fill in my eyebrows with the classic Anastasia Beverly Hills. Does this job every time, love it. Uh, then contour time, gotta look chiseled. Gotta look sculpted. This is Charlotte Tilbury, best bronzer. Then I like to move on to putting it in my eye. Well, I don't put it in my eye, but like around, yeah, around my eye, around my nose. Uh, highlighter time, Becca Champagne Pop, classic. Uh, I put this on my nose, my eyes. I also use a little bit of my Kylie palette just for funsies. Then I do brow gel. Then the most scary but crucial part is the winged eyeliner. I just feel 10 times hotter with a cat eye. Like, look how hot. Wow. Then I curl my eyelashes. Um, once I'm done being dramatic as frick, I then put on some mascara, then I like to check if I'm sweating, which I think I was, it was really hot, uh, and then I put on more mascara, and then I put on my MAC Saw Lip Liner, and then my Charlotte Tilbury, uh, lipstick in Pillow Talk, and that's my makeup done! <laughs> Okay, so I filmed my TikToks and my makeup is done, my outfit's on, I look amazing. Let me show you guys real quick. I'm like really running late. Less than 10 minutes to get that, but this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing, this is the dress. Oh, wow. I look insanely good. What even? It's time to slay New York. So guys, I just took like an $8 taxi to go like three blocks, but now I'm sat down at Zuma and I'm drinking a lychee martini. Literally, I'm sat here by myself. Like, I really don't give a fuck. See, look at the vibes around here. Look at it. I got sat right here. This is my little table. Look at my little shishito peppers. I feel like the workers are staring at me as if, like, I'm crazy. Because, like, I'm literally here by myself. But also, like, I'm hot. Like, does it matter? No. And this is New York. People come and visit here all the time. Hot people visit here. Mm. Not as hot as me, but, like... to live out my Wattpad fantasy right now and just like have like a really hot like New York like mysterious investment banker like come and like sit over like right next to me and just be like hey like how are you and just like talk to me and like actually be interesting though like I, I don't want them to be boring and then just like never speak to me again this is so good I always like ugh when I'm like drinking alcohol but that's not ugh like that's good like I would drink that just for like pleasure and I can't say that about most alcohol Toby. Toby texts me, he goes, I thought you were having a break from social media in New York. No, that's what you told me to do. I never said that. I never said I was going to do that. I told you I wanted a post when I come to New York. And you're like, yeah, but India, I think the best thing for your mental health right now is if you take a break. So actually, Toby, I never said that. Thank you. That was you all along. Oh God, such a hater. Uh, my sushi arrived, so that's good. I forgot to vlog that. Guys, don't yell at me. I spoke to my ex, and now I'm kind of in a shitty mood. But also, did I do that to myself? Yeah. Yeah, I did. Am I gonna blame myself? No. Nah. No, nah, I'm not. Tell me this piece of sushi. I'm fucking... Guys, I don't know why one drink... I don't know how one drink is looking to me, but this one drink... It's strong, to say the least. Like, this drink is strong. The smart idea would not to get another one. However, like, I kinda want one. Oh, I was looking at them because I wanted them to flirt with me. <laughs> Maybe they just didn't have the confidence. They were definitely interested. They just didn't have the confidence. I am drunk. Well, no. That's a lie. I'm clearly... I am not drunk. But if I'm being honest, I feel tipsy. Oh, it's so texting me. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna go out tonight. Bro, I just wanna go partying. Like, that's all I want. Do I wanna be a whore? Maybe. Maybe. But look at this mini walk of art. We have a dessert. It's a ice cream sorbet. That's really good. 